Oops. Okay, so today we're going up and checking out our pond that we made or our water hole. Uh, it's been raining a lot and it's been about three weeks since we've been there. So super excited to go check this out to see if it's holding water. Even more excited to see if deer actually used it and checking on the food plot and see how our baby's doing. So let's go to Adams County. So we made it to Adams County. Let's go check these watering holes out. And we also got a turtle. You been in the hole, son? <laughs> he looks like he's been in the hole. Oh. Let's go check it out. When... I lost it. I trying to catch it. Welcome to the water hole. I don't know if you just seen that or not, but as we were coming down the hill, we jumped a deer up. I believe that was better here. I don't know. I just seen it as I was going up the hill, but it no, it's blowing at us. But anyway, let's go take a look at this water hole for the first time. And I can tell you, because I cheated and I can see it from where I'm at, it's still there and it has water and it packed down nicely. But before we check the camera, let's just look around it, see if we can see some tracks. Now, there's a tr definitely a track right there, a fresh one. So that might have been the one we just jumped. She literally might have got a drink today. Boys, that is freaking awesome. That is freaking freaking awesome i love doing stuff like the food plots in this watering hole and seeing success with it and that track would not be there unless it was getting a drink let me show it to you there's actually a couple of them now that i look one there actually that's a little baby track there but right there is the big one oh, you can see that right there right there let's check this camera right now We got behind the ball on this plot. It's still, I mean, there's still a lot of clover in there. It's still a lot better than it was before we did anything, but it is definitely being overtaken by weeds. So I think what I'm gonna do, in two weeks, we're planning on coming back up and spraying the bottom food plot to get that ready for fall and everything else. When we do that, I'm gonna spray this one as well. And then we'll overseed this, which I was planning on overseeding this anyway. So yeah, we're fine, we're fine. If we were not gonna do anything else with this field, we'd probably be in trouble. I mean, just take a look. I mean, there's definitely clovers if we go down well not here that's basically all weeds but if you come up in here and you look down through here you start seeing all clovers chicory there's clovers there's chicory all in there and everything else so excited it's a little nerve-wracking because this thing used to be nothing but clovers you know as in prior videos as you've seen and stuff and now when you come up and it looks a little bit different you know it kind of hurts your soul a little bit even right now there's still a lot of food there's still a lot of tractability is that a word tractability sexiness deer appeal whatever word you want to use go with it but our mineral site where the lucky buck is has been destroyed looks like we dumped toxic waste which maybe we did i'm not sure but our cameras are right there let's check these cameras out so yeah seeing those fawns play around that water hole was freaking awesome that's freaking cool gotta love all of our hard work that we've been putting into it paying off for us we're seeing babies other deer are coming in just can't wait to see how this all plays out come this fall freaking awesome seeing the seeds in the ground drawing in deer the water that we put the sweat digging that hole it's all paying off for us and i cannot thank you enough for helping me do it man with all that i hope that you're excited i hope you're freaking excited about all this man it's amazing. So until next time, thanks again for your help and hunt till it hurts. <laughs>